Not that was mother osmosis. Sipa. The written word was previously available to a small, often wealthy elite. Now, knowledge and propaganda can be distributed to the masses. Advancements in metallurgy and metalworking allow the creation of rapidly replaceable typefaces revolutionizing printing. More science in every research quarter and more adjacency from research quarters. More science for researcher and more research slots. Both of these are very good for science. Okay, so then I think we'll go flintlock and then mercantilism. <clears throat> So how are we doing on the old milestones? Militarists we finished already. We're four turns away from three-star science. We are almost certainly going to get first-star expansion. Unfortunately, we're still like 19 away from the population, which I'm not sure I'll bother waiting for. Will is still sullen. Okay. We just built another ship. is a better way of attacking it. Except I apparently can't because that's a cliff. That way I can. Well we may as well piece Quill out first. Okay, so what do we want from you? Is that a different colour? Where's Homam? Oh, it's up there. It is one of theirs. So they would be giving it to me, but I, I don't have that many. I don't have that much interest in that. Uh, my scene, we definitely want, although it's going to be incredibly expensive to take it. And it is adjacent, I think, to this, which we're going to want. So we can have the adjacency. So we're going to want Gnosis, and we're going to want this, Nervia. Oh, these, <laughs> these were things we were going to get anyway. So what I'm going to do here, so I'm going to throw in a quick save, because the peace deal system in this game is still kind of frickin' janky. So we want Gnosis, we want Mykene. Madavav is that island. Nagor is that island. So I'm kind of okay leaving you the islands. Although I have a feeling that somebody else is just going to come and kill you if I do leave you them. I can take one of them, so I might as well take... Nago. You are generous and well appreciated. We would all benefit from growing closer, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, Quill. I grow closer to your cities. Ha <laughs> ha! Wow, we completed a lot of milestones. We actually got level two military because we took so much land. So we still need another two turns for the level three science. But that is just... Leapfrogged us into first place! Ha <laughs> ha, Marbazir! Still two eras behind, by the way. This has been a very valuable war. Very, very valuable one. And we're going to take Thebes. We might even take Halkaranga. And we're not friendly with you. We could we could just steal Madanav. So that's going to be one, two. 
Uh, where's the other one? Thieves is just one, so that's three. Uh, is three enough? No, I need one more. I can get one more! We're expanding over here! Alright, let's go and attack Hokuranga. This is not the best angle of approach, unfortunately. I'm not putting the artillery at the front. Are you mad? Not the best places because they're downhill. But they're mortars, they don't really care about that. Alright, so that's a steep cliff. That's not. That's not. Yes, it is. That's a steep cliff. That's. That's also a steep cliff. Is there a way of rotating the map? Because that would be kind of useful. You can attack there, you can attack there. Alright, so I think that I need to basically bombard you. Death! That in the wrong order. Didn't really want the level three going in there. Cliffs don't stop me. We have guns. Weapons ready. All right. See what they do. Oh, they do have a ship in this battle. Where are my ships? They're nearby. Go and see if I can bring them in as reinforcements. Mordred, do you have any contact with anyone at Creative Assembly? Their Total War Discord is hacked. Yes. Hacked how? Oh, I see. Someone posting news. Yeah, I'll send a message now. to you, and one to you. I'm sure they're aware Creative Assembly is a big company, but send messages. I had a friend that also got hacked on Discord, apparently through a Discord bot. Yeah, Discord bots are a problem at the moment, unfortunately. Oh, crikey, they're banning all of the CA people on it. Wow, okay. Yeah, they're talking to Discord. It's what you get when corporations are not penalized for neglecting security. There's only so much you can do because hackers are constantly trying to get around it. Okay. Um, so I need to continue my bombardment against you. Then I want you to shoot them. I want you to advance to here and shoot them. 
shoot. Shoot. And shoot. And that's that round done. Oh no, boats! I forgot the boats. Can't be done, it's not my turn. Alright, now it's my turn. Never fear, Navy's here. This is a good opportunity to get the uh, the ships a bit of experience. And we sank the ship. There we go. All right, bombardment time. Let's make sure that the level 2s do as much damage as possible. And that's Surakanga taken as well. What an absolute blitzkrieg we're having at the moment. Just tidying up the borders a little. Uh, four away. Will now wants to trade, and you know what? I have no real reason not to. Oh, we took Sparta? <laughs> okay, so we are, yeah, quite significantly over our city limits, so we're going to need to do a little bit of compression. Probably merging Mycenae and Gnosis. We're going to need to spend some influence to sort this, because we're also about to take Hurakanga and Thebes. Oh, sorry about this, Indrin. Noah noticed the Ark was sinking, he hated woodpeckers. The Gospel of St. Helfric, the Modology Bible. That's a good one. Does this make you Mordred the Magnificent or Mordred the Conqueror? I would say that this is Mordred the Magnificent, considering, you know, Ottomans. Do units fight to reduce strength when wounded? Yes, yes they do. Mordred the Magnificent Conqueror. Oh, I like that one even more. You guys know how to speak to my ego. So, what do you desire? Uh, you are now afraid of me, yes, because we have level 2 traitor. I mean, we're a traitor and also a merchant, so, you know, it's not all bad. <laughs> so, tell me, how are you today? And the Brazilians are still totally chill with us. You know what, Quill? I have nothing against you anymore. Your proposal makes Whipple. good sense. I say yes. You actually have a fair number of resources I can buy I as well. I can only say that this is excellent. Including silver, which adds more science and research quarters. That sounds like it might be ever so slightly useful. Very well. I accept. Plus also stability. You have access to coal? Huh. Then salt, which is extra food. I'll pass on that for the moment, because I don't know if I'm going to need my my money resources for anything else. Greetings. You have need of me? I... Oh, it's not worth those? worrying about. And you almost... Uh, tea! I know. You won't do it again. My deepest thanks. 
We'll buy that, that's for sure. See, everyone hates us and yet we're buying all the things. We're, we're just good merchants, it's just good business. That's all this is. Can you reach him? No, but you can. Oh, no you can't, it's a cliff in the way. Interesting. And there, they have an actual army. So I think I did the right thing in bringing my, my troops north. And you've set up right next to Mbaza Congo. That's brave. There, Poland. That's very brave. So how long until you peace out? You're losing eight. Stole your spoils. Siege from Malhun following a war we were both involved in against the same opponent. We're at war with each other, Moogles. Um, right, so... Yeah, we're going to need to do something with Gnosis and Mycene. How big are they? Mycene's... Mycene's really big, actually. One, two, three... Four provinces. So I don't think the Mycene's going to be able to be absorbed into anything. Gnosis, at the moment, is only a one. But once we take Hurakanga, we can probably merge you into that as well. And then the question is Thebes, which I'll probably merge into Babylon. I'd really like to merge Yasunapura into something. Maybe I'll merge you into Sipar. Although that's going to make Sipar a frankly redonkulously big city. Yeah, you really need to get your food up. Improved. So I think that's what I'm going to work on next. I know this is going to cost me some production, but I don't really care. And your stability is fine. Now that we're buying a lot of resources, I think stability is going to be fine from now on. So we can do some pretty massive expansion. Oh yeah, we can move into the next era. We've been able to for a while, but I'm still trying to work on the milestone. I want to get this one, and I want to get the science one. Which will be two turns. Alright, armies, you chill here. Um, you guys might as well march on Cahokia, honestly. Now that I know that Poland's going to be dealing with Mbaza Congo. Uh, you guys may as well head into Gnosis. You guys may as well head into Mycene. You guys can't move. You've been waiting patiently here to establish another outpost. And as much as I really want to build these cities, I'm not going to be able to afford to for a bit. So I'm going to say go ahead and build the outpost. Just so we can claim the territory. And head back over that way. You guys are going to chill here in Gnosis. You are hunting the horsemen. Okay, construction time. So your stability is currently zero, but it will tick up. You've actually got really good food production, so you're going to grow nicely. Um, but in the meantime, you're basically only going to be able to do stability stuff. So City Watch, we are 100% want. And then I'd say the Apothecary too, because you have a lot of science districts, apparently. And then, who's next? Gnosis. Gnosis also has a lot of science districts. You could do with more food production. Let's just make you a full science city. So let's go with the city watch. Then the aqueduct. No, city watch, then apothecary. Gonna make those scientists work for their keep. Sparta. Sparta, I feel like we can 
probably... Oh no, Sparta's actually got a bunch of things that will want to merge into you. Um... I mean, this actually gives us access to silver. A lot of access to silver. And then pearls there in the north. And then possibly oil. Probably oil. So, honestly, we're going to want one of our armies going up here to go and claim Homam. And that'll also give us more silver, which means that this place, yeah, can become a uh, silver manufactory. So, what is Sparta going to do? Well, Sparta... I'm going to make productive for the moment. And then you're basically going to do the same as the other cities, except you've already got all of the upgrades. And you started with 100 stability. Okay. Um, interesting. Because you weren't under occupation for very long, I guess. So what we can actually do is build a hamlet here. So we can get access to all of the resources from the river. You have a train station already. Era is Quill in. Early modern. But he's already got trains. Interesting. So if you transition as a... Sorry, if you transcend as a science sieve, then I guess you keep your plus one era buff. Hadn't considered that, but makes sense. And Quill was producing a heck of a lot of science. Well, that was a large Quill army up there, I just saw that. You're trying to ride past my spies. Let's go and chase you down. I think we got you. I think we got you. Get ready, attack! Aww. And then we also have this big attack on Cahokia coming in. Kind of okay building some trebuchets. You. What is it? Because they do have another army. Oops. If I could zoom out, I can have a look at it. There's another army up there. Okay, let's see. Naval ships are going to go and chase you down. So all giving me war support, it's fine. And then the Janissaries, you may as well stay there. You guys are going to stay there. Barusa finished your construction. You are building construction. But unfortunately, your city is within the limits of this fight, although you yourself are not under attack. So then the question is, what do I want you doing? Did the Khmerans have an elephant as a unique unit? Yes, they did. Which was this guy. The Ballista Elephant. As opposed to the later Cannon Elephant and Gatling Gun Elephant. Pouring myself some more tea supplies. Oh, Kalunas wanted me to drink some tea. I am sorry, I missed that one earlier. And Salil Grover, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the channel. This one's for you, Kalunas. Ah, okay. So what do I want this place doing? 
Plus two food per farmer. We only have five farmers. I don't think that's quite worth doing yet. 2% science per saltpeter, which is basically four more science. And more science per researcher. We do actually have quite a few researchers here. But I think right now what I want is more farming. How much production would building here lose me? None, actually. Really? Those are rocky fields. That definitely loses production. That's a lot of production we can gain here. I feel like this is going to be more of a production region. Ah, here we go. This is the food. 14 food. There we go. That's what I needed. Another one here. And then you can get some nice adjacencies. Awesome. And Rome also finished. It built its walls. Well, you go ahead and get some of these cheaper structures up and running. So we stay current with the infrastructure projects. Chartered companies researched. The creation of charters and shares allows companies to manage and take greater risks in the hopes of greater profit. Two money on outposts. Banks give percentage. Money per trader. And science per population. Era star unlocked. That's the science star. So I think we are now maxed out on everything that I can do this era. We could get the influence. We could get the money, but I'm not going to wait for that. No, I want those two expansion stars. You're going to peace out in three turns, probably. Um... for that. Where's that horse gone? He's up there. All right, well, if the horse is up there, I'm going to have you coming over here to Hominam to see if we can just steal it with the expansionist uh, ability. Actually, no, I don't want the ships just chilling there. Ships come back to here. Quickly attach two outposts to existing cities. Yeah, I know. I'm just not so sure that I want to attach these. I mean, actually, this one to Barusa would be okay, because Barusa's only two. That's one. Could add Sabria to Constantinople. That would be a monstrous city. Which I guess makes sense. It's freaking Constantinople. Cost 2,000 to attach. But then again, it will cost 10,000 to establish a new city. So I think at this point we kind of have to. There it is. Here's star unlocked. So now we can advance. Although if I advance, then I can't take Homam. 